Hello everyone! This video is part of the Lamia series, which is under the Human Extinction Story Project I've been working on. Unfortunately, this is part 2 and cannot be listened to as a standalone, so please make sure to check out part 1 before this video begins, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe so I know what type of content you guys like. Enjoy! So what you're saying is that you possibly come from a different universe? Oh my, this must be fate that brought you to my door for sure. Hmm. Well, your body seems to be adjusting just fine to the climate here. Oh, similar to Earth. Your planet, I'm guessing? Perhaps parallel universes. Oh, who knows? My world? Marriage? Why are you curious about marriage? Oh, uh, well, I guess you're right. Lamias do run on a multiple male, single female system. I'm not a huge fan of it. The wolf packs have a much more romantic system. One paired faded one for their whole lives. How sweet. Oh my, Earth as well. I thought humans ran on a single male, multiple female system. No? Oh, how interesting. Looks like humans have evolved. Lamia sure do need to catch up. Oh well, I can't care much. Either way, you're so warm. I'm never letting you go. No matter how many friends snuggle with me under the sun, they'll never be able to compare to your warmth. After all, you're warm by nature, and we're just cold. Huh? Oh, no, no, no. No male Lamias dare approach me. I'm too scary and ill-fated. Anyways, you don't need to know about my horrible reputation. I can't scare you away first thing, right? Oh, right. I meant to ask you. If you were actually sick, what would I feed you? Hmm, does your body work the same? Do my potions have the same effect on Lamias as on you? Oh my, we have to try this. Oh, it's for research purposes, I promise. Allow me to just mix a little bit of this. It's an experiment I've been conducting. It's worked on five out of six lamias I've tried it on. I'll add a small dose, since you're much smaller in size than most lamias. After all, you don't have a tail. Oh, just imagine the experiments I can conduct on you. Please, don't be scared. I won't dare harm my beloved heat pack. Here, drink this. Oh, just trust me. It won't be that bad. You'll just feel a bit feverish. Maybe needy. But shouldn't be too bad. Just trust me. I won't hurt you for sure. You seem like you don't believe me, huh? Well, I wouldn't try kill my own heat pack, huh? I still need you down here. Here, drink this. It's sweet. <laughs> Baby pink. What's wrong with its cute color? It's just the color dye. I promise. What type of potion? My oh my, you don't need to know that. I mean, you'd know the second the effect starts kicking in, but there we go. Should take 30 minutes to come in, for Lamia's at least. As you're sitting there, I'll go get... Mm -hmm. Why are you holding on my tail that tight? Ow. Oh my. Your face is already blushing up. How interesting. Looks like this love potion works faster on humans than anyone. It usually takes at least half an hour for it to start kicking in, but it only took minutes, matter of fact, seconds for you. Might it be too heavy of a dose? Hmm, how weak. Oh, don't worry, it's not going to do anything to you. I extracted a certain naughty ingredient, so you'll only feel half the effect. It's just going to make you feel a bit soft and needy of attention, nothing else. Oh? 
Oh, I was forced by the King Python to make this. She's so mad about this one Lamia, so she wanted me to make her a love potion. It's possible, of course. After all, I do possess high volumes of magic. That's an explanation for another day. Oh my, is your body temperature supposed to increase again? <laughs> oh, you're starting to get hot. How warm. Oh, I might have just overdosed you. Are you okay? Here, lay down. Oh no, don't want to lay down? Sorry, I maybe, maybe I should have halted myself choosing potions. Oh, I mean, I did try to cut the volume by half. Guess a quarter would have showed that your body reacted to the same as Lamia's. Why what? Oh, why the love potion? <laughs> well, I needed a potion that had fast effects, with minimal side effects, so the love potion would have been the best choice. I mean, look at you. You're so cute and pouty now. Sit down. It's fine. You'll be fine. I should wear off after a day. Or, well, in your intense case, maybe after a few days. At least I extracted the most uncomfortable ingredient. Oh, you don't need to know that. Okay, okay, look my bad, all right? Don't be angry at me. How about this? I'll go buy you some pastries from the bakery. How does that sound? Yeah, you like that? Here, you gotta stop holding my tail for a first. Yes, I know, it's cold and cool to touch, especially in your overheated state, but... You know, the ice around you is also cool. I can make you a temporary ice bed if that helps. Painful? Well, I suppose so. Hmm. Here, how about this? You can sleep in my bed for now. It's still cool, but not as painful as the ice. Oh, here, I'll carry you upstairs. There we go. All tucked in. Oh, looks like this time you're actually sick. Have a snooze. I'll be back in no time. Get you some food as an apology, hey? <laughs> looks like my potions work on this little pet. It'll be a lot easier that way. I mean, <clears throat> it'll be a lot easier to take care of you. Thank you, that will do. Oh, I can't, sorry. I have a new little pet waiting for me at home. Huh? Rabbit? Did I say I want a rabbit as a pet? Oh, yes, maybe. A very big rabbit. Anyways, I'll see you later. My rabbit will be sad if he's left alone at home. Oh, no. Home. What day is it today? Oh, no. I should have thought of this earlier. I must have been overexcited about my new friend. That's right. She's visiting this afternoon. My sister, that bratty king. Oh, gosh, I gotta get home before her. If she finds out my human, she'll be sure to try to take him away from me. I'm back. Oh my, what a cute little thing. Sister, why did you hide such an interesting species away from me? I thought we shared everything. Would you please get your hands off him, you King Python? Go be obsessed with someone else. That one's mine. Thank you for staying with me till the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I can't wait to see you again.